Well, uh, one of the things, of course, uh, the star of the film, uh, Chevy Chase, like, there's no doubt in that he is a comedy legend, but there's, there's so many stories you hear of him maybe sometimes a bit like uh, Sean Connery, not suffering fools gladly or suffering idiots or geniuses or pencils or pens or whatever, just that sometimes he's in a shitty mood. Uh, you, you can kind of see over his career that it kind of like uh, after the with, with the Invisible Man film, I can't remember the name of it, it, it really seemed that his career fell after that. And like, it, I don't know if you've ever seen his Comedy Central roast where he turned up in sunglasses, he wouldn't take the glasses off, uh, he wouldn't laugh at any of the jokes and there was all these young up and coming comedians and it was just like, it was just so so many bad vibes. So, for you personally, uh, how was your experiences of working with uh, Chevy Chase? For me, it was great. I mean, he wanted me to do the movie, and uh, we got on great. And and um, you know, uh, I was fun. Was what he should have been on set. He he was funny. He was generous uh, he you know he um i dare say i probably couldn't have done it without his major support on every level in other words he was the wind in my sails he was behind me on my decisions um when i had disagreements uh with his co-star uh he backed me um and uh you know so it, it turned out um to be a, a a very positive experience for me. I mean, I can't comment on on the kind of circuitous, um, you know, post vacation decisions he made, or you know, all of that. Because I, you know, I um, the only time I saw him recently, I mean, relatively, was when I was doing a, a show called Chuck, and uh, he had. He was hired for a, a run of Chuck. I didn't direct those, uh, but my my uh, colleague, uh, Robbie McNeil, was directing them, and I was prepping my episode. So I I did, uh, we went out to dinner, we hung out, and, uh, you know, I found him the same old Chevy. He's a very good piano player, too. So we went, I think we were at Beverly Hills Hotel, and he sat down and played piano and so my, my memory of him is is fond and and uh, continues to be 